Brooks and Dunn on Y100. Today is Tuesday. It's rodeo time in Texas. And uh, here for the Nacogdoches Pro Rodeo and Steer Show, it's uh, Dustin Beavers and Anita Scott. What's going on? Oh, not much. We're just getting ready for the rodeo. Yeah, big things. The 23rd <laughs> through the 25th, right? That's correct. Yeah. So the rodeo, it seems like the past few years, it's been getting bigger and bigger. Yeah, and that's all thanks to the Nacogdoches JCs. Yeah, you guys are working <laughs> super hard, too. I mean, what? everything. First class operation. I definitely think it's a combination of both the JCs along with the Anita and her staff. Uh, we work really well together, and, and it seems like each year we get bigger and better. So. Absolutely. Yeah. Um, to get tickets, how do you go about doing that? Because I know people, some people want to prepare a little earlier than others. Exactly, and, and we, we really encourage that. You can save some money doing that. Sure. Um, Boot Boy in Nacogdoches is selling them, Bowles Feed Store on okay. South Street in Nacogdoches, and you can also go online at outhousetickets.com. Okay, so that's the easiest yeah. way if you're sitting in your office right now. is uh, You can go by Boot Barn on a break, or you can go to outhousetickets.com and uh, pick up your tickets. Now, um, a lot of nights, of course, the 23rd, 24th, 25th, so three nights. I mean, not not five or six or anything like that. So you've got it compressed into those three nights now. Yeah. Anything different on the Thursday night? Well, talking about tickets, yeah. uh, Thursday night uh, admission is free, sponsored by Southern Power. So we do request a $2 donation, and all donations uh, go to the Cushion Angel Tree. So oh, cool. Come on out. It's the first night. It's a lot of excitement on that first night. And mm -hmm. so come out and, and, and support a great cause. Yeah. yeah. And then uh, Friday and Saturday night, always uh, a big time for everyone. Right. We are often offering a on-band special for $12. Okay. Um, and that'll get you in the, both nights of the rodeo. So we did a put the pencil to um, paper and um, just kind of broke it down for a family of four to come to the rodeo. That's provided they pay the $2. Um, sure. To the, the requested $2 to the um to the uh, Cushing Angel Tree. Yeah, on, thank uh, you. That's yeah. on Thursday night. On Thursday night, yeah. yeah. The, we break it down. It's less than five dollars per person to come to the rodeo every single night. Oh wow, that's awesome! Right. And it's yeah. always a fun every time, night. especially if you yep. go all three nights. You know what's going on. You exactly. can kind of keep up, keep up scores and all that kind of stuff. Exactly. And yeah. uh, these riders are as professional as it gets. That's I mean. exactly right. And also, um, uh, we hadn't mentioned uh, but, um, Rudy Burns. He's a legendary. Uh, Specialty act. Okay. Um, so he's going to be there performing for us, entertaining the crowds and stuff. Uh, stock the stock contractor is Pete Pete Carr, classic and pro rodeo. Pete Carr is big time. Yes, he I is. I mean that's that's he's everywhere. Everywhere you go, yeah, you see Pete Carr um, stock contracting. Yeah, this so. is not a you know a little rodeo. I mean this is a professionals here. It's award winning, right? That's right. It's award winning. <laughs> a couple of years ago, uh, Nacogdoches was um, was uh, nominated for best small rodeo of the year wow and then this past year the wpra nominated uh, or actually selected us as the best uh, small rodeo for 2016. So, that's awesome yeah it's big things and, you know, uh, pleasing a uh, barrel racer is not easy so <laughs> 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 no but you can you can go and watch and uh, what time does it start every night um well what, the gates is going to open at 6 30 okay. each night and that'll give you time to visit the concession stand shop with our vendors sure uh and even ride the mechanical bull so the uh, mutton Beston will start at seven o'clock and then it'll be followed by the rose lake equestrian drill team will perform also cool and then the actual pro rodeo action will start at eight o'clock so get there in time to watch mud and busting yes. it's always a fun it's always a fun it. time yeah, <laughs> just, those just kids, if you, yeah if you watch that that's thing. the future yeah. of the rodeo yeah you know? <laughs> everybody seems to have a great time yeah. what uh what year is this for the nacogdoches pro rodeo and steer show do you oh, know yeah i was asked that now I, I wish i would have uh, looked them um, it's I, a lot yeah, it's, old, it's, old. <laughs> it's yeah. been around a long time, right. and it's uh, been doing great. Like I said, over the over the past three four years, it's just kind of grown and grown and grown, and a lot right. a lot of excitement. Right. So right. Uh, go and go and check it out. And you said vendors. Now, do you still have vendor spaces open? Yes, we do. Okay. Yeah. How do and, people do that? Oh, well, you know, they will contact our office at five six four zero eight four nine. That's there at the expo center. Okay. Karen Klein is handling that for us, and um, the. Vendor booths range anywhere from fifty dollars to one hundred and fifty dollars. Easy, easy month. I mean, that's you know. For all three nights. For all three nights. Oh, okay. I thought you yeah. meant per night. No. no. So if you've got something to sell, yeah, this is the place because there's going to be a huge crowd. That's right. There always is. Um, so you can get out there, you can sell your product, and all you have to do is call the Expo Center. Probably don't try to memorize that number because it won't work. Just Google <laughs> Nacogdoches County Expo Center wherever <laughs> you're like at. It's on Facebook. Yeah, or, or like them on Facebook, and yeah. uh, you can get a vendor space. When when will you guys stop selling those? Uh, 
you know, we, right up till the event. Yeah. Unless it sells out. That's right. But so you want to get in. And it could sell out. So you want to get in now. Right. If you've got something to do. Anytime there's a crowd and you've got something to sell, you want to be a part of it. And for those prices, you, can't you know, you it. should up those a little bit. I know. Well, <laughs> well you know, we I always tell to... people that. You can get more for that. I know. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, we want to make it affordable. We want for the community to be uh, to be able to be a part of it. Absolutely. And, um, so, you know, we just uh, want to make it. We need to make a little money for the county, for the JCs and sure. stuff, but at the same time, we want to make it affordable for everyone. Now, uh, speaking of the JCs, if you want to get involved, if you're listening and you're thinking, "Hey, I want to get involved with the JCs," how do you how do you do that? You can start helping out at the rodeo, huh? Sure, come on out to the rodeo. <laughs> yeah. Basically, you'll you'll notice the JCs wear uh, blue uh, blue shirts on Thursday and Friday, and then of course we'll have our pink JC shirts on on breast care, uh, breast cancer awareness night on Saturday night. Okay. But just come up to us. Come up to one of the guys wearing the blue shirts, and uh, and, and and we can talk to you and answer any questions. You might we, we put on multiple events throughout the, the year and just like the rodeo uh, we, we love to give back to the Nacogdoches community so we'd love for Nacogdoches and Lufkin to come out and, and have a great time so just come up and, and holler at us. Absolutely so real cool stuff happening the 23rd through the 25th not too far away. Yeah we you also know. have some more stuff going on yes. in conjunction okay. with the with the rodeo um, on Saturday morning they'll ha have a trail ride. Oh yeah. So, yeah so if you want to uh, if you have a horse or whatever and want to participate and if you don't have a horse they are also going to be down at the park uh, what is that uh, freedom uh, the festival freedom festival park yeah. downtown Nacogdoches yeah. yeah if you want to bring your kids down there get close with the horses and stuff the, the riders are down there they love whenever people come down and and uh, see the horses and things like that yeah it's so, a cool event we talked to them last year and uh, it's a it's a fun ride and I think I didn't yeah. know at that point that anybody could get involved but you can and you just need to you right. know, get Pam through. Hamby actually handles that for us and so um, if you're interested in um, more information about the trail ride of course you can always go to our Facebook page and we've got information on there but you can also contact Pam Hamby at uh, 564 one 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 nine. Okay. Yeah. Cool. So okay. that happens that Saturday. So if you want to have a day of a uh, rodeo based action, you can do it the Saturday of the rodeo and check yeah. out that trail ride. Yeah. Maybe get involved if you've wanted to get in trail rides. That's a good start because yeah. it's not it's not like the old Spanish trail ride. It's not hundreds of miles long, but no, it's, a, exactly. it's a good yeah. starter ride. Yeah. So um, but, you could do that and get involved. Yeah, and, that, and then all the participants that uh, that do participate in the trail ride will also have the opportunity to ride in the grand entry on Saturday night of the rodeo. Oh, cool. Yeah, and and. Um, one other thing that uh, we also we also do is w once the ride is over, you everybody ends up at the expo center, and so we have a tailgate party for oh, all yeah. of those, and we feed them and everything, and that's sponsored by CC Smokehouse and uh, Pilgrim Pride. So we'll feed so. all of those uh, riders. You definitely want to be a part of that because yeah. that's that's amazing <laughs> food. So yeah. check that out. That's that's all Saturday. Uh, that's right. Fridays. Have we gone through all the events for Friday? No Thursday. Um, well, you know, we also have the steer show going on. Yes. So that's they come in on Thursday, and then they'll have their show on uh, Friday at 10 a.m., and uh, then they'll have their uh, buyer's appreciation dinner at 5.30. Okay. At 6.30 is the show, and so, uh, excuse me, the um, sale. Yes. Uh, for the steer shows. So that's at 6.30. That is right. important. So if you want right, to right. get in on that and you want right. to be a buyer, maybe your company, maybe you want to split that up. It's a that's right. heck of a donation right. to make. Um, yeah. You could do that, and that's at 6.30 yeah. Thursday. On um, Friday. Friday. Okay, yeah. 6.30 on Friday. There we go. Yeah. Right. No. Getting confused. So much. What? There's so much stuff going on at this rodeo. <laughs> Just know. go all three days. Here's how you sum this up. Just go Just all go three all days. days. Check out the Facebook page and uh, look and see what's going on and take part because it's a cool thing that happens every year in Nacogdoches and I have this big pet peeve of people in Nacogdoches saying, now mind you, I'm from Houston. I've lived in Nacogdoches for the past 16 years. People saying, oh man, there's nothing to do here. <laughs> There's something to do all, all the, the time. time. Just yes. do it. When you're listening right now, and then after the 25th, and you think, man, I miss the rodeo. There's nothing to do here. <laughs> no. It's the 23rd through the 25th, Nacogdoches County Expo Center, Nacogdoches Pro Rodeo and Steer Show. You need to be there. Come on out. Extremely affordable. It gives you lots of money to spend on great food and all this stuff with your vendors. So, Anita... Dustin, thank you, um, as always, for taking the time out of your day, and we will see you on the 23rd through the 25th at the Nacogdoches County Expo Center. Thank you.